It's an awesome, Florida State is awesome, Florida State University is awesome. I mean, I had, I met some really good people, made some very good connections with these people. And Odell Haggins is definitely an awesome man, so it was definitely fun. What were some of the highlights of the trip for you? Um, some of the highlights for the trip for me was expansion the pre, it's like a preview center, it's like right there in town. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Probably the dopest thing I've ever seen. You yeah, stick I mean, the spear in the yeah, ground. Yeah, it's pretty dope. I mean, I've been on me doing that was amazing. I mean, talking to Coach Novell, talking to Coach Higgins, it was like amazing people. The players, fantastic people. I think Florida State is on the uprise this year. Obviously, is um, sorry, Brent. is obviously really good at developing guys uh, yeah. as far as players in your position, but. What did y'all mainly talk about when you're around him consistently you know, throughout the weekend? We talked about the relationships, love, and ball. It's basically it. Relationship, love, and ball, and what the community can do for players like me and anybody in general, how this place is very traditional. And then with your relationship with Coach mm -hmm. Higgins, I guess, how has that been built recently, and, and what stands out about him? Me and Coach Odell has been, had a relationship since uh, he first offered me scholarship here. He never let go of communications. We talk almost like at least a probably twice a day, every day. And basically, it led up for me to come here, knowing that I can academically register my first year and stuff like that. So it's been a major, major, like, you know, turnaround. So the more they kept on recruiting me, recruiting me, made me more interested to come here and visit and what, have everything, what they have to offer to me and what I have to offer to them. And it looked like we, you know, connected on that on that level. With the football side of things? Football where... and relationship side of things and you know, just the community. The community here is like one of the communities where like you post something about what happens here, it's like everybody already knows about it. Everybody in town knows about it. So it's pretty dope. Um, with Coach Rodell, did he specify where along the de defensive line he likes you? What position? Both. Nose guard and three tech. Okay. Um, what did you see from how they how they utilize those guys like Robert Cooper? Oh, man. Um, he had, he might have had three guys going to leak it um, this year, and those are the guys that are about to graduate. And he basically wants me to come in and fill in that circle and that, you know, that area right there. So, I mean, I think that's pretty dope. I think... I think the work that I can put in in any any school or what it can have for me is just like, you know it's very awesome. It's definitely you know one of them. You get one of good get, tree. You get to talk to those guys. I guess what did they yeah, kind of tell yeah, you? Yeah, I talked to them guys. They told me. I mean, I've I've never heard anything bad. I mean, even when I was home talking to my mentors over that case, it may be like, who is Odell Higgins? Who is this guy? And everybody knows who this guy is. It's like a legend around here for some reason. So, <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say you took three official visits over yeah. in a row. Yeah. Now you obviously decision, I guess, down the line. But uh, yeah. when when do you want to make your decision? Most likely in the next couple of days, few days. I mean, I have to talk to my coach, and I really had to talk to everybody in my family. See, you know, tell them how I love the experience, and you know, stuff like that. So I think my sister's probably a big FSU fan, so I'm pretty sure you know she's gonna you know, enjoy the talk. So <laughs> pretty cool. Yeah, pretty cool. Oh, you have something right? Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> it's on deck now. Who are the contenders? So. Say the um, you have Virginia Tech, you have um, Virginia Tech, you have Arkansas, and you have UConn. And Florida State. Yeah, and Florida State. Okay, I thought you meant like <laughs> other than Florida State. Yeah, <laughs> Come on, Dustin. <laughs> Was there anything that you were kind of searching or looking for when you came into this visit? Right? Authenticity. You know, how are they real? As are they as real as how they are talking to me on the phone? Mm -hmm. You know, that's all I look for: authenticity, love, relationship, and home. Coach Norvell, did you get a chance to sit down and talk to him? Oh yeah, yeah, for about an hour. How was that uh, conversation? Amazing guy. I mean, he's like that. Is he like this every? I'm not trying to ask you. Yeah. Is he like yeah. that every day? Pretty much. Yeah. Yeah. He's an amazing guy. Yeah, yes. I trust. I trust that guy. I mean, I feel like I trust that guy. He's very like energetic, wise, and that's like me all the time. So I mean, I love that energy. I love that energy, and it is hot. I love that. Energy. How tr how easy is that going to be a transition if you do pick Florida State or whatever school? You know, to jump right so, into the 2022 yeah, class. Yeah. So if that was the case, I'll be here by be back here by Wednesday. Oh. Wow. Yeah. Have you turnaround. thought about that potential turnaround? What that would be like? Just I never. Yeah, <laughs> I just like I just was ready to go into the next year, play football, twenty three class, and come in the transfer midway. And the way that turned around is was I was very happy, but very scared. But mm -hmm. the fact that you know, I have these four schools. What am I going to pick in this short amount of time? You mm -hmm. know, it's very scary. But I feel like I have the right people around me and the right knowledge about this place and every other place for them to really for me to really know. Do you feel good about coming up on your decision now or you know that you, you have, have an idea a clear, where you clear want mind? To go? I have a clear mind. I have a clear mind. I definitely have a clear mind of what I want to do. And you know, always I'm gonna release it to but I mean I'm not a big media guy regardless, yeah. but like I do try to post where like where I go and what happens around yeah. the area and I think I'm pretty good with that. So I mean I'm I'm gonna release it someday and just, you know, hope everybody enjoys the, you know, 
the social media type deal the aspect of it. I <laughs> you mean, should post it on Twitter. Yeah, Twitter, and Instagram. You know the the basics. And the, if I do come here, I definitely want to do get like a following up. Just like you know, I feel like I come here and do some great things here. I'm mean, as a 17 year old being here at a camp, so it's pretty pretty cool. Appreciate it, bud. Would you no, come in at height weight wise as well? Uh, I'm at six three point five, six three point five, three hundred and eleven pounds. How'd you do in the cooking competition? Uh, we were supposed to win that. We got the cooking competition. We were supposed to win that. I was mad. You, you guarantee victory. Like, bro, we were supposed to win that, but it was a pretty. That was probably the best hands-on experience I had at FSU because I've never done that anywhere else. So who was your Who was your partner? It was Scoop from um, Oregon, the okay. defensive back yeah. transfer from okay. Oregon. What did you guys cook up? Well. Huh? What did you guys cook up? We did. Uh, like elbow noodles and alfredo sauce and like put a little bit of cilantro. It was pretty cool. Some peppers, cut on some peppers. We did it. I mean, we had the right vision. We were really supposed to win, but hey, I wouldn't say that. We put a garlic knot on the side. It was wow. pretty good. Yeah, Who were the judges? Um, it Who was two of the players. It was two of the players, one of the strength and conditioning guys, and uh, the trainer, the trainer, okay. the, um, doctor, the doctor and the trainer room. <laughs> okay. Gotcha. Awesome. Pretty cool.